I like it that everybody thinks the same. You have different cultures. That really gives you much more to work with. There is just so much to do and see and, you know, a variety of classes to take. Travel offers a lot, which is really good. The size kind of creates a sense of community. It's a great school. You should cherish your high school because it goes by really fast. Purple High School, where you experience new things and memories are made. You being a freshman, you're probably very anxious to walk into a new school. Maybe you're excited, or maybe you're scared. Either way, there are a few things you must know to help you make it through. We will show you what's expected of you and what you can do to help improve it. What do you like about Preble? What do you like about Preble? Alright, so what do you like about Preble? First of all, I love the positive attitude that there is among the staff. Every student has the opportunity to learn um, at their own level. We get lots of different people to meet. Really some wonderful opportunities here. It's a, it's a really it's a conducive to learning environment. We offer a lot of advanced classes. We also offer a lot of classes for kids that struggle in various areas. I also think Preble has a lot of great activities to offer and I think we do a great job here or we try to do a great job here of, of finding different activities and different sports and, and music activities that really connect to all different students. I like the variety of clubs and sports that we have at Preble and giving all the students that because we're all different and unique, so it gives us a chance of like getting involved in what we like to do. The students have a lot of school pride, a lot of school spirit. It's fun on the dress up days, everybody gets really involved. And more than other schools that I've seen. I enjoy the labs that we have, like math lab, science lab, literacy lab, the foreign language resource because that just gives students the chance to go get help on off periods. Students as well, like Sting Cancer is, an, is a unique organization to Preble, as well as things like the Knitting Club for, for kids who are interested in, in doing activities like that and, and donating their time to knitting things for the needy. Um, we also have Do Something Club, which is a really interesting organization about doing things for others without, without being concerned with having the accolades and the recognition for that. And I like the Career Center because I'm a senior this year and that gives me the opportunity to go like for college prep and everything and I can see my college respect too, but. Stay on top of your school. Get involved, there's a lot of activities here. I think um, if you do that, um, it, it makes your time more enjoyable um, here. Enjoy it because four years are going to go quite quickly. You find a focus and you find things that you're interested in, you're going to find other kids that are also interested in in the same types of things. So Preble's always home, regardless when when you leave. But um, I say just enjoy it and get involved. I do think tardiness is a big issue in our building, and I think it's something that we need to really work on. Freshmen should expect to be treated like adults. This is something you should avoid. We'll show you how. We'll show you how to get from one end of the school to the other without being late. If you know your class is on the other side of the school, be prepared. Know where your stuff is or have it beforehand. We have six minutes and plus it's annoying. I think a lot of tardiness is just kids being social. Um, they talk, you know, it's a chance for them to meet with their friends. Take the fastest route. Don't stop to talk to friends. What I usually do, like, I just try to ignore people just by putting on headphones. Avoid stopping to flirt. Don't be late to class. Be respectful to your teachers. Um, I think it's very disruptful to teachers and others when kids continually walk in late. Taking a drink at the bubbler is faster than buying a drink at the vending machine.
if you're going to talk to friends, make sure your classroom is nearby. When you hear the minute bell ring, run. You know, for the kid that's tardy once or twice a semester, I don't think that teacher is going to be concerned. You know, we have that one minute bell and sometimes they make it in a minute, sometimes they don't. One of my teachers, like, there's a kid that doesn't want to participate and falls asleep in class and everything. And then she like narrows the work down for him and like we're writing pages and pages of work and it's just like seriously, you just give him like a paragraph kind of thing. We have kids that are missing out on important things that are going on in classes. Freshman year counts. You can't just hit the rewind button. You know, you've got to make sure that you start fresh at high school and remember that it is important to do well right from the beginning. Don't wait until you're trying to get ready to graduate. Get into you know, music, arts, uh, dance, uh, take a foreign language, of course, I'm going to say that. So make sure that you get involved in clubs that speak to your interests. Even if, you, if you're scared to go to a club, grab some friends and just go, because you're going to have a good time no matter what. But clubs that I'm in now, like, that's a really long list, but um, I did basketball, volleyball, martial arts, gymnastics, cross country, winter running club, Bible study, link crew, FCLA, GSA, flight, FFA, Asian club, Stink Cancer, and Max Scholars, Stink Cancer, Bible study, Gay Straight Alliance, Operation Snowball, and Science Club, which is also at Southwell. You should cherish your high school because it goes by really fast. Well, I think if you could talk to seniors right now, um, they probably would say that, wow, where did the time go? So make the most of it, enjoy it, and um, you know, Preble's always home, regardless of when, when you leave. But um, I say just enjoy it and get involved.